Yeah, it, it's a very different world um, that we're talking about in the, in the mid seventies. In in as much as things have changed, so much of it is. Changed. And that's something you you. Yeah. Oh yeah. Because I'm sure a lot of actors are experiencing the same thing that you experienced forty yeah. years ago. Yeah. Yeah, 50 years ago. And also, but in the last 10, 20, 30 years, I realized that a lot of guys, white guys, that I definitely support in their programs are on the, not on the conservative side, but also conservative. For instance, Tom Selleck. I just that, I look at practically every episode of Magnum KPI, right? And I realized that, uh -huh. you know, really, Tom, you know, uh, Clint Eastwood. Right? Right. Oh I my said, goodness. really, Clint? You know, really? You actually uh, vote for this guy and you like this guy? Uh, to me, it's unbelievable. And I'm outspoken right. about it. Uh, you you know who's another one? Anthony, uh, what is her name? Angie Jolie? Angie Angie Jolie? Jolie? I didn't what's know that. Name? Really? No, no, not her. Her father. Oh. Uh, John Voight. John Voight. Who? Her father? Very, very much over the other um, side. Yes, John Boyd. Yes. I didn't know that. I didn't know. Oh, yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. You, you, I mean, before he passed away, I mean, and this is going back ancient history, but you, had, I, I, I remember seeing a documentary with Charlton Heston, and this guy was so... Conservative. I, I couldn't even finish the documentary. Oh my oh, yeah. god. Yes. Moses. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Yes. You and I both know that Moses was brown skinned. So that that had this white yes. red eyed motherfucker playing Moses, just so the extent to which the Jewish relation, Jewish people, had become white, because you and I both know Judaism is an African religion. The first millennium of yeah. Judaism is in Africa, y'all. Sure, in the last 200 years or so, in this country, white people from Yugoslavia and Czechoslovakia have represented it. But the first millennium of it before African migrated to Europe and to Asia and to the other countries, it was black people, brown people, tan people, Catholic people, and yes, some white people who were Jews, but the whole Jewish population was not white in Africa. And what pissed me off, after the Jews got their state in 1948, about 20 years later, when the Ethiopians were facing problems with what is refugees came to Israel, the Likud wanted them to be re bar mitzvah and re bat mitzvah as if Ethiopian hadn't been Jews for like millenniums. And the Jews in Africa, right, did you that. didn't know that? Yeah. No, no. Matter of fact, the Ethiopians claim to have the actual ark uh, with the Torah in it. They claim to have that, I know it's true. But yep. Judaism is an African religion, like Christianity is also an African religion. Jesus was a woolly-haired, brown-skinned man Born in Bethlehem, y'all. So you're talking about two African religions which have been wrested from Africa by white people and have made people to understand and believe that Jesus was, was white, which he wasn't according to Revelation, the first chapter, 14 to 15 verse. Jesus was woolly hair and bronze skin. Have you seen one in any other church you go to? You know, I just had this conversation with a, with a good friend of mine a good friend of mine, and we were having it, it almost to the T, the exact same conversation. And I'm like, you believe in the Bible? Right. It's in the Bible. The Bible said he had skin of bronze and he had curse. And they call themselves literal interpretation, interpreters of the Bible, which really pisses me off because if you don't have that, that's something you have to believe you're not a literal interpreter of the Bible. What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. 
And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.